Let's turn it up. Positivity now. 2018! Leave Trinity Football. Random divisions. Uh, number 11. All right, let's go ahead and roll the die. See what we got going on here. We don't do ones and we don't do deuces. Oh, man. Empire. I got stories for days. <laughs> I got stories for days. I'm, I'm not proud of it, but it, it, it's made me who I am. And, and I'm definitely proud of that. You know, and you know, growing up, I've always, you know, I've I've always had to, uh, you know, grow up quicker. Be, you know, having been through some of that stuff. Um, you know, but but everybody goes through some. You know, everybody has their own demons. Everybody has, you know, their own story. You know, this just happens to be mine. So you know, I, I'm definitely, you know, I'm definitely a better man having gone through all that stuff as a kid, you know, and, I, and I've always had to grow up quick, I've always had to, you know, observe, you know, others and, you know, learn from other people's mistakes, you know, mainly my family members, you know, I hate to admit it, but my family, <laughs> you know, I love them to death, but let's just leave it at that. All right, we're going 11 times here. Let's see what we get going on. Boom, 11, as the die has said for us to go. Copy the names, drop them here, paste it, and now we got the division, so let's random the divisions. Empire, that's a funny, that's a, that's kind of a long story, but long story short, uh, I'll front going 11 times here with the divisions. Long story short, one of my best friends who I went to high school with posted a like a status on Facebook asking if anybody was interested in, it, in making it like extra money and I'm always down to make extra money I'm always down to do something strange for a little bit of change money shot 11 boom so there's the uh, the divisions so I hit him up about it I'm like yeah you know whatever so basically I got into it uh, started off as a sorter and I did that for a couple years where I was just sorting breaks uh, shipping them and all that good stuff and then eventually the opportunity arose. Uh, you know, my one of one of you know my partner here, who uh, who I like to call the money man. He gave me the opportunity. He's like, listen, man, do you want to be a breaker? And you know, I'm like, I don't know, bro. I don't know anything about cards. I don't collect. I'm not. You know, what I'm saying like I'm not in the hobby. I don't know anything about this. I'm not a salesman. I've never sold anything in my life. Like. I, I, I couldn't sell water to a whale, you know, or I should say I, I couldn't sell, what it, like, you know what I'm saying, like, whatever, so, the first year I started as a breaker was, was extremely rough, I was probably breaking maybe a box every week, you know, I would stream like eight hours a day, and I'd be lucky if I broke anything. So the first like eight to twelve months were like absolutely rough, and then you know eventually, eventually it just I don't know. It's I can't really explain how or when it happened, but eventually uh, I got decent at it. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say I know everything about breaking. You know, every day is a learning experience, but that's pretty much how I got into it by chance all right exactly the Moses mojo kicked in because I mean listen for the most part you know some of you guys like Chris Fitz if you're watching he's one of them Ra Ra's another one uh, Kate Daisy M M McBapa uh, Giordano Insane Beans, like there's a bunch of folks out here. What up, Matt? They're, like there's a bunch of folks out there uh, that still break with us to this day. And like Ra Ra could tell you, man, there were there would be days where like I would not break anything, and then eventually I just figured out, you know, because I, I would just imitate a lot of other breakers, and you know I would try to emulate them or whatever. And that wasn't really working for me. So, you know, the moment I decided to, like, do my own thing, 
that's when I noticed the change. But I'm definitely nowhere near where I want to be. You know, if, if, if I had to give myself a ranking, I would probably say we're like... I don't even think we're like top 10 breakers like in, in the community. I know a lot of you guys say, oh, you guys are the best. Well, but like realistically, I, I don't even know how to answer that question as far as how, how where, where we're ranked. Well, dude, Big Ten, I, I already, uh, dude, how many, how many shout outs you want, Big Ten? Make sure you guys uh, check out Big Ten analysis over there. Give, you know, give the man a sub, give him a like so he can leave me alone. All right, here we go. Got Michael Gallup with the autograph. Galloping over for the uh, Cowboys. The Cowboys are NFC East. So there's a hit right there for them. You know, Ra Ra could tell you the first year or so was brutal for me. <laughs> Looking back, I'm glad I got through the the rough portion, or I should say the roughest portion. You know, some days are still rough here and there, but at least now I kind of more or less know what I'm doing or what I should be doing anyway. Empire, I appreciate that, even though you're you know just uh, boosting me up. You know what they say, flattery gets you everywhere. And there's Roquan Smith is nice. That goes to the Bears. Bears are in the NFC North. There you go. No worries, Big Ten. It's all good. Plenty of love to go around. No need to apologize, baby. I can't knock the hustle. We got Ralph Webb, 2 of 10. Nice three-color patch with the autograph. Ralph Webb. Did we have to random him? I don't think he ever played in the NFL. Let me see here. Oh, Ralph Webb is currently a stealer. He's on the Steelers practice squad. So Ralph Webb is a Steeler, which is AFC North. Uh, yeah, I'll show it to you on the recap, uh, Marcus. Let me get through this here. Boom, there's one more in here. Two more, I'm sorry. We have a Troy Fumagalli patch auto redemption. Yeah, Ralph Webb used to be a Patriot, then he got dropped, and then he got picked up by the Steelers, which is his current team. He is a practice squad player with the Steelers. Troy Fumagalli, the name is familiar, but who do you play for? Troy Fumagalli, according to this, is a tight end for the Broncos. Broncos are in the AFC West. I appreciate that, Big Ten. I mean, listen, that's that's one thing I can say I got going for myself, you know, because trust me, I spent a lot of time watching other breakers, trying to copy what they do, even like copying like what they say. And, you know, being fake is something that just, you, 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 you could detect it, you know. You can't, you know, there, there's a saying, you can't bullshit a bullshitter. And, you know, if you're being fake, more often than not, people are going to realize that. So once, once I started being myself, that's when things started, you know, getting better. So, again, it's still not where I wanted to be, but uh, definitely getting there. And uh, this is pretty nice. Josh Rosen! On card autograph. Luckily, he's still with the Cardinals. So, go Cardinals. Very nice. Nice hit right there. The Cardinals are 
in the NFC West. So from the looks of things, every single card goes to a different division. So definitely spread the love around here. Let me go ahead and uh, put that there. Boom, boom, boom. So before I do the recap, let's roll the die here. See who gets what. We don't do ones or twos. You know, see, there's a two. Why the hell? Three times the charm? Apparently not another one. What the hell, man? I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. All right, we're going to go ten times in the random. This is to, uh, well, before actually, before I do that. Now, let's do the recap. So AFC West, got the Troy Fumagalli patch auto redemption right there. So AFC West is in the green. There you go. NFC East, we got Michael Gallup right there. So the NFC East in the green. There we go, Mark. Finally got you a hit, my dude. The NFC North, Roquan Smith, sick hit right there. Uh, let's see, Defense Sire, Player of the Year. Well, I'm pretty, I, I know that says defensive, but it's not that bad. It's not that bad. The spelling on there. All right, NFC North. He's a way better speller than you, Marcus. Boy, I've seen you spell some words like, boy... Like you had Tourette's and you were typing or something. We got Ralph Webb, 2 of 10 right there. That goes to the AFC North. So, boom. And last but not least for the NFC West, Mr. Josh Rosen. Ah, Marcus, I don't want to hear that BS. I don't want to hear that. All right, NFC West getting a little hit right there, baby. Boom. So we got three hitless spots. Bob got two and Joshua one. So let me see. One of those three spots will get a spot in the next break. Wow, Empire. You almost, almost caught an aneurysm trying to read that. Anyways. We got three <laughs> Marcus. All right, we got three hitless spots here. One of these three will get, or I should say, one of these two will get into the next Trinity break, which is the last one too. So here we go. Good luck, y'all. Going ten times. Six, seven, eight, nine, and the money shout ten. Ten times. My man, Bob. Bobby. You get a spot in the next break, my man. Congratulations. We'll get this out to y'all. Thank you very much.